Well, if you take a look around town, it is easy to see there is construction happening all over the place. Buildings are going up, roads are being repaired, and that means construction companies are hiring. Our Kim DiGiulio takes us to Howell, to the largest construction career fair in the state. This isn't your typical job fair. When you come to a room, stop at a desk to learn more about a company. Now that's part of it, but it's also a hands-on career fair, so you can really get a feel for the work that you're interested in. The school buses kept coming, dropping off thousands of students for the 14th Michigan Construction Career Days, all ready to grab a hard hat and get to work. It's 4,000 students and 500 chaperones over two days exploring all the exciting careers in construction. It starts with your traditional career fair format. Then there's the hands-on portion. You guys ready? One, three. One, two, three. Even getting the chance to operate the heavy-duty construction equipment. Excavators, bulldozers, a back hose. We're talking about all of the aspects that go into the construction industry, and there are so many aspects. The event brings students from 120 school districts across the state, from 7th to 12th grade, boys and girls. This is a, a, an industry that now is for everyone, truly everyone, um, women, men. Um, you know, it doesn't matter where you're coming from or what your background is, there's a home for you in this industry. Giving these students a glimpse of what could potentially be their future career and the opportunity to build the future of our state. We hope at the very least they have a good time and learn more about what construction entails. Uh, we certainly hope some of them choose this as a career path and spend the next 30, 35 years building this state of Michigan. The event will also take place tomorrow. However, it is completely full. So if your child's school did not get to participate, make sure their school inquires about being included next year. In Howell, I'm Kim DiGiulio, Local 4.